after we all stopped fucking with Sage, she started telling people that I called in her daughter's school and had her daughter be searched and her daughter was holding a vape. I don't even know what school her kids go to, number one. Number two, Sage, you buy your kid vape stuff, right? Uh, also, on top of that, that story happened in like January, okay? So in the screenshots, you will see Sage, uh, somebody asks her what happened with the school because Sage was contacting the school to talk about that whatever happens between with the search and the kid. You see, I blacked it out, but Sage dropped an email from some official at the school that was trying to contact her about the incident and Sage calls her a lying bitch and says that she's had her phone with her all day. But three months later, I, I did it. I did it. How does that work? That You seem to do that a lot. You seem to say something happened and then you just change the names later on. You've done it a few times, but anyhow, here's the screenshots. Also, I forgot. Uh, I don't use text now numbers. That's why my phone number was so well known because I just use my regular number, right? Um, but you know who does? Sage does. Sage does. So interesting, right? Also, I just want to know how it became I contacted an 11 year old child, but in Jamie's post, she said a 15 year old. Mm, that's strange, right? We'll get to that.